We're now in Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3. We're running at 1920 by 1080 for resolution. And you can see our advanced settings right here. Everything is set pretty high. Anti-aliasing was set at 2x by default. I've increased it to 4x. And by the only thing I haven't turned on is ambient occlusion. Let's see how it plays. These are really good frame rates for pretty much all high settings on the NV15 at 1080p. Now we're going to test out the HP NV15 playing Elder Scrolls V Skyrim, and we've chosen medium detail settings. The game actually wanted to go with high, but I think it didn't know that we were going to go for full 1080p. 1920 by 1080 is our resolution. And you can see we've got four samples for anti-aliasing, and anisotropic filtering is turned off. And our texture quality is high, radial blur is low. Shadow details medium and decal quality is medium, which are the default settings for medium gameplay. Now you can play on high, but you'll get 20 to 25 fips, which isn't so desirable, so we're going with medium. And medium settings, the detail is actually quite nice in the game. We're doing low to mid 30s for FIPS.
the audio quality is very good, and the volume is pretty good, considering the Skyrim is a relatively quiet game. So now we're playing Fear 2, we've got all settings on max, and we're about to enter a pretty busy firefight. Nice lighting and detail. Sound effects are great with the Beats audio, too. Harlan, this can't go on. She's too dangerous. You were telling me to seal my daughter away. You knew it would come to this. We both knew. Sergeant Beckett, what's wrong? What is it? 